More power to you, man. <laughs> I have a few notes, so let's see. Well, for starters, I, I wasn't fortunate enough to meet Andy till the end of my college experience at UCLA, and I feel like he kind of filled a gap that I didn't have from the get-go and, like, made college so much more fun. Um, I feel like I definitely, like, have that in me, but Andy, like, helped bring it out towards the end of college and, like, we were able to share like so many fun memories together. So one thing that I wrote down that I wanted to mention is, out of all of our apartment friends, oh Andy was the only one who was spontaneous and fun enough. Also, I probably wouldn't have done this if not for him. Yeah. <laughs> well, like it was the week before finals, and we got like he got like free two free tickets to the Pac-12 tournament, and like we had a bad oh, basketball great. team. We, we were not gonna win at all, and like. Me and Andy rented a convertible and like drove to Vegas. Oh, <laughs> 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 we rented a Mazda. <laughs> <laughs> it, wasn't, it wasn't a Mazda. It was a Mazda. It was a Mazda. My parents rented it for us. <laughs> Probably the best part is that I had never like tried sports betting at all. And for some reason, I followed Andy's lead that weekend. We literally hit 11 out of 11 sports bets. <laughs> and, and then I remember, like, the drive. I had such a fun time. And then on the drive back, like, he was like, let's ride convertible on the drive back. And I was like, I had to DD the whole time. So I was like, no, I do not want to do that. And he was, like, so persistent. So for, like, 15 minutes, we're driving like this down the freeway. And then finally, he's like, all right, maybe we should put the roof on. So I pulled over and we, we put the roof on and, like, drove all the way back to us. Anyway, that was just one of the memories that stood out. Oh Additionally, Andy, like, probably saved my life on a houseboat trip that we went on. Oh my God. <laughs> great, great. Like, I, I woke up in the morning and I had like a cut in the back of my throat and I was like, <laughs> yeah, I'm probably sharing too much, but he, 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 may, he might have, yeah, he helped me out a lot that night. No, I, I wasn't fully aware of what had happened. But anyway, it was on a houseboat trip that didn't facilitate. <laughs> <laughs> they can probably tell you better than me, but anyway, I was there. Yeah, we there drank too much. <laughs> so then the debauchery of college ended, and then focus shifted for Andy. You know, he moved into an apartment with Nate, and he started dating, and he did. He met this girl that he was pretty excited about. It turned out to be Wes, and then I was, I was excited to see that she matched his like positivity and spontaneous fun spirit so i feel like they're like a super good match for each other and like my she has my mom's stamp stamp of, not that that really <laughs> 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 i'm like i'm like getting married to my yeah, like, <laughs> 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 they've been together is they're always super gracious whenever I go over there they like cook us meals and like are just really like nice like they like welcome us all the time in our house I think me and Griffin go over there like whenever we get the chance and then I like to say West is just getting a great you know a great dude that's dude that's a great guy someone who's you know genuine always down to have fun and I, I just wish you guys many great years you know coming up um, I'm really grateful that you guys included me in the ceremony. It's the first time that I've been involved in a wedding since I was a ring boy when I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I up tomorrow, cut me some slack. <laughs> <laughs> I think you guys put me in a perfect role. So. <laughs>